You guessed it, ladies and gentlemen, we have a new roommate that you have not met, and today I want to go over kind of everyone that lives at our house because I feel like a lot of people are confused at who actually lives with us, who's moved out. How are you guys? I'm great. We're surprising our uh, friend with an eel. Kids! Kids! We're almost there! We're almost there, everyone! Do you guys know where we're Disneyland? going? Are we there yet? No, no, Mateo, not Disneyland. Onion farm? No, Jake, we're not going to a onion farm. Sea World? No, no, see, guys, we're going to see Guaxzilla. <laughs> and I'm not talking about 1.0, oh, oh. I'm talking about the second one. 2.0! There's two of them? No, it's, it's the second one. And I first see a double fried <laughs> Surprise! Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to another video. We are at SD Wrap right now. I've been getting so many questions about the GTR, and the video came out, and then it was gone for a month, and here we are, okay? I'm giving you guys a GTR update. Bursting with excitement. What about you? What are you doing? What are you doing? I don't know. I'm, Open the door. Uh, <laughs> moving on from what I was saying, I kind of rushed the car in order to make that video because I promised a deadline to you guys, so that is is why we're here. The car's almost done. It's not completely done. For today, there's um some pretty exciting things that I get to show you. And surprise guests! Popcorn, hey, you vlogging? I'm vlogging. Hey, that's what's up, I vlog. I vlog, I vlog. Let's vlog together. Vlog. Popcorn's here, Justin's here, and uh, they brought the sexy, sexy, sexy R8. Oh my gosh. It has like a rust texture on it. It's it's it's, it's, a, it's a really unique, unique thing going on, but but more importantly, Quark still back in the land to find the car. There he is. Where's the car? How she look? How she look? During the process of the GTR build, we took the car out on some pretty crazy roads and the front bumper ended up like cracking because the splitter rods were not in the correct spot. So they had to rewrap the bumper and fix the front bumper and a whole lot of other stuff. Here she is. The first reaction. Oh, oh my god, I missed this thing. You haven't seen the interior. Oh my god, I forgot about that. Oh, and surprise, I never talked about this actually. We had vinyl right here over the wheels. So these are Vossen wheels. So Bumpers all back intact. They had to patch um, some cracks right here. Those are done. What do you think, bro? This is Guaxilla. I've been talking about it for so long to you. I thought I did crazy stuff to my car. Bro. Get my car, bro. Like We're gonna get the keys. You haven't even seen the inside. Oh, yes. Feels good. This is my first impression of the interior. Here we go. Oh, that was a great first entrance. Look at the door panel. None of this was here. We have all new stitching. Whole Alcantara door. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, so actually one thing. The steering wheel's not done. But look at this. Holy cow. So this is all Alcantara all along the door. And this. Holy cow. Oh! Look at the little detail. All right, ready? Ladies and gentlemen, for the first time, the Guaxilla cage. Look at this. This was not here before. And it says Guaxilla. The wrap on the outside, same green. So we got the full cage now. Look at the interior. All Alcantara. Black. Some nice little light green stitching. And this is now gloss carbon. This before was just dry carbon, so it kind of matches the whole theme. Oh, look at that too. I have not seen the new shift knob. So many little things. Now for the like the most important part. <sighs> look at that. Big magic, you dig? So this is the GTR update, guys. It's not coming home quite yet. Few little tiny things we need to fix, but uh, I'm gonna give you guys a full rundown of the car when it's actually back. We're actually gonna take the GTR over to 2M, so we're gonna take her out, which is good. We're all just looking at it, because we haven't seen it in so long. I can't wait to have this thing back done, and my car is going to be at SEMA this year, and I'm so excited for that. I went last year, and it was an awesome time, and to think that now my car is going to be at that show, I'm super pumped for it. We need to make sure the car is completely ready for that event. I'm sitting here thinking, we forgot to start it. <laughs> we just started looking at it. All right, here we go. The E85! Do it again. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's solid. Fitment's good now. This was a huge problem. Make her do a squat. Now go up. <laughs> Ooh. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, 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 oh. And the cage. Okay, this is starting to set in. Okay, I'm getting excited. Look at these two beautiful cars. Going on a little date. Maybe Kylie. What's your car's name? I have a name for you. Well, your car has to be a boy. Your your car's rusty. Ooh, Kylie's got a boyfriend. Ooh, Kylie. Come on, get in there. Go talk to him. Go talk to him. Yeah. All right, listen, Russell. I got to give you a one-on-one. -on -one. All right, this is my 
baby, right? You better treat her right, okay? I don't want you around if you got the wrong intentions, all right? He's gonna ask her out. So, what would their babies look like? It would be like a V10 twin turbo. The baby would come out looking like a watermelon. Red, green. <laughs> oh, sh we put two supercars together and we get a watermelon. Yes. Boom. That's how they're made. Yes. Now it all makes sense. Enough talking. We're gonna go out. Imagination, and we're trying to find some rubber bands. We are, in fact, looking for rubber bands. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> yeah. oh, you gotta do it bad, though. Let's see you who can do the, shook the worst. To, yeah, the worst. All right. Okay. Okay. Let's see, Bear. All right. Go ahead. What you got? Oh, don't do it. Don't do it. All right. All right. All right. Ooh. 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 Oh, that kind of look good, though. I don't know how many we're gonna need here. Do we want the thick ones? We're all doing it. So we should get the thick ones. The thick what about ones the colorful there? ones? In, in order to do what we're about to do when we get home, we need a lot of rubber bands. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we can spin them all individually. <laughs> well, they're all bagging area. We spent six thousand dollars on rubber bands. We spent thirty-seven dollars and eleven cents on rubber bands. Here, get the thumbnail. Hey guys, you know that that's bad for your lungs. Smoking's not good for you. Check this out, yo. Uh, morning, Fox fam. Starting the vlog off, I'm finna go ham. We're pulling up to PetSmart, maybe get a fish. I don't really know, but you know I'm cooking up this heat dish. Uh, we had a new roommate. We gotta welcome him kindly with a new... Kylie. So, will they eat goldfish? No. Oh, wow. Can I take one eel, please? Yeah. Never thought I'd say that. Oh, I see them. That. Does it get any bigger? Yes, they get, what is it? How 15 excited? inches. It'll be like the length of your tank. You ain't seen my tank. It's a big dog. My tank bigger than you think it might be. You guys gonna name him? Yeah, his name's Brady. Oh, you already got one. Yeah, we have a bunch of roommates, and every time someone adds a fish, it's named after you. So if your fish dies, you die. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Why did I say that? <laughs> that wasn't smooth. We have a new roommate that you have not met, and today I want to go over kind of everyone that lives at our house because I feel like a lot of people are confused at who actually lives with us, who's moved out, and kind of what's going on. So we're going to be going over that today. We will be introducing you to the new roommate, Brady, um, with this new eel. How are you guys? I'm great. We're surprising our uh, friend with an eel. Shh. All right. We're going to go surprise the new roommate, Brady, with his brand new, one-of-a-kind eel. So this is Brady's new room. You guys are gonna meet him in one second, but we have to welcome him into the house. Entering. All right, listen, man. I know the vlog hasn't met you yet, everyone. Brady, meet vlog. Vlog, meet Brady. Hi, vlog. Listen, man, one thing about this house, we got a fish tank outside, okay? Everyone who lives here has their own fish. Go you, on. You didn't have anything in the tank that represented you, you know? No, no not so personally. I, I got you your dream fish, man. Close your eyes. Turn close, your eyes. close your eyes. You're not expecting it, bro. You're not ready for this. Cl just close your eyes. I can't cry on camera. I told just you this. Close your eyes, man. I'm gonna give it to you. Put your hands out. Oh my gosh, is it Nemo? It's better. It's better than Nemo. Whoa! What the heck is? Is that a slug? 
It's an eel. eel. Oh, it's an eel. Good eel. Is it gonna zap us? No, no, it's good. <laughs> it's healthy for the tank. We double checked. I'm healthy for the tank? Yeah. So you wanna go Oh my gosh, I'm a helper. All right, all right, all right. Hey, buddy. Is it a boy eel or a girl eel? It's whatever I'll you want though. it to be. Hey, this hey, is insane. who surprises you with a eel? Oh, bro. gosh. It's totally going at my hand. Oh, I feel so weird. I can't wait to see the eel in the tank, though. Look at the variety. There's so many different fish. I kind of want to call it Larry if it's a guy. Do we know? Well, you have to name it after you. It's how do you? Brady. Yeah, it's just oh, Brady. that's how that's this works. The, the, that one's Tanner. This one's Johnny. That one's Maverick. That's just Ligma. All right, go ahead. Put him in. Put him in. Open okay, the bag here up. We go. <laughs> I want to see what it looks like when he drops. Where are we dropping? Where are we dropping, boy? Q Fortnite sound effects. <laughs> I'm gonna screw this up on the vlog. Oh, no, we got, we got. Oh. Ah! Oh, He's an eel. Look at this. We have an eel in the tank. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? He's, He's back here. here. He's back here. Look at Brady. He's just hard chilling. We have a frog, and now we have the new eel. He's hiding. Anyways, welcome to the tank, man. Thanks, dude. Happy to have you. In other news, <laughs> Kiki has a taco. <laughs> Come on, Kiki. Let's go outside. Get on out, dog. Get a little taco. Get a little taco. Come on. Come on, taco. Get off me right now. Kiki, it's a taco. <laughs> Come on, man. She is not respecting the taco. This is a fail. It's Halloween. Have some spirit. She's so too smart. She's too smart. It was worth $16. It's Halloween, spooky season, Kiki. You're supposed to be dressing up. She listens to my mom, apparently. Kiki, you should now taco. Happy Halloween. I'll take a chicken taco to go. Hi, taco. Look at <laughs> Kiki. Look at you. Happy Halloween. Look, it's Kiki's a little taco. Ladies and gentlemen, this is what happens when you buy one of those costumes from PetSmart. She's just, she's broken. All right, that's Kiki's costume. We're back from the GTR, we're back from Walmart, we're back from getting Brady his new eel, and today I wanna do sort of like a roommate style video. There's been a ton of stuff going on at this house with people moving out, and kind of just a lot of drama, so if you wanna kind of understand um, what's gone on the past three months, comment down below and I'll talk about the situation with who's moving in, who's moving out, who actually lives here and who does not. For now, we are gonna be doing a challenge. It's Halloween, it's spooky season, we have two pumpkins, we have some rubber bands, this is kinda gonna be our little uh, activity, We're basically gonna race to see who can blow up the pumpkin first. We have a massive pile of rubber bands. And while we're doing it, Johnny's gonna ask us some questions. So, you guys ready? Going down. Oh, this yeah. is going our down. game, oh, no, Fox. Okay, let me go introduce down. everyone. You know Baird. Baird, yes. this is Baird. Baird, you guys have met Baird a few times. This is Brady. Brady just moved in a couple days ago. Um, so you guys will get to know Brady. And uh, I have a meal now. Y'all know Mateo. Mateo. <laughs> has been in the trap for a, he's, he's been in here for a minute. He's in the trap for he a minute. He has. We're gonna start doing rubber bands and Johnny's gonna ask some questions. <laughs> Y'all ready? The yeah, Halloween yeah, challenge and then you guys get to know us. Alright, ask us questions. Why are Johnny? the pumpkins wet? Alright, hey right, what's the best part of living together, guys? Bear, do you start? I think all the crazy stuff we do. It's, it's always something new. Best and worst. Be honest, man. Alright, I'm be being honest, bro. Honest. There, no, there's no, no, been no. some drama. I guess that comes down to, you know, people moving in and out. There hasn't been a lot of drama lately, though. No, no, no. no. Lately, not it's now. been great. Not Brady, go ahead and answer. What's the best and worst? You just moved in. Yeah. <laughs> but Everybody's considerate of each other. That's kind of what's awesome. You might get roommate roulette happening, and you have to live with randoms that don't really care about you, but everybody in the house care about each other. And it actually shows, just like off camera and the things that we say to each other. All right, now what do you hate about everyone? <laughs> Our driveway is full of cars. It makes it so hard to back out. Yeah. <laughs> That's actually a pretty... That's actually kind of... That's true. a real reason. That's like a real problem. Right, Mateo, what's the best and worst thing about living together? Uh, best is everyone supports each other in anything they want to do. Everyone's all full like, yep, okay. let's like get that. it. Worst, there's no like worst part, I like how we're just putting but everyone kind of gets on each other's nerves once in a while. Once in a while, and which we'll makes sense. Like... At that point, you just kind of call everyone out on their yeah. So my favorite part about living together, coming into this house, my goal was for everyone to like be able to work together, help each other succeed. And by what they all just said, seems like we're doing that, so that's pretty cool. Worst part, everyone gets on each other's nerves. Like that, at some point, you know, someone does something pisses you off, and you just gotta call them out for it, and then you fix it. But that's the, that's the glory of it. All right, we're doing it. two at a time. Uh, How? We're gonna be real. We're doing like five yeah, at a time. Yeah, jokes okay, on so you. Ah! Oh, oh my that's, gosh. That's scary. Ah, we did five at once. Oh, oh wow, yeah, we did that. Yeah, we've been doing ago. that. We've been doing we did that. that. Everybody's ages. Pull it down hard. What's, what's everyone's ages? I am 20 years of age. Cannot say. Cannot say. 
Well, that's gonna remain a mystery. But yeah. hold I am 18 years of age. And I am also 18 years of age. All right, what's a pet, pet peeve of each other? Pet peeves? Hey, name one pet peeve about everyone. Man, I don't really just have any about, about Brady, though. Okay, we'll skip Brady, because Brady, guys, so Brady's brand new. Brady's yeah, yeah. perfect is right. what Tanner meant to say. All right, so yeah, I'll start with Mateo. Brady's perfect. Ah, no. <laughs> now that we got, like, a good roommate squad, like, these are kind of hard to think about. All right, so Mateo. I don't know, is this gonna get... Let me talk. Yes. <laughs> I can't talk. <laughs> I can't talk. That's your pet peeve. Yo, dudes, don't let me talk. We're How so are these fools go putting in so much work, dude? Bro, I don't know. They've done this before. We're the sure. ones that go to the gym, bro. Yeah. Shut up, man. I don't have a pet peeve about Baird. Like, there's nothing wrong with that. That's Baird. what I was saying. Mateo. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> sometimes you just piss me off because I try to give you good advice and you just kind of, you take it, but like half of it. You, you kind of put it away for storage and you don't you don't use it. Hey, that's, that's fair. That's real. Yeah, that is. At some yeah. point, I want you all to keep in mind that one of these pumpkins are going to crunch. Okay, so I'll actually tell the story on how I met everybody. So I met Brady in Utah through Sean Duras. I met Baird at a trampoline park. It's called Tempest, you guys might remember. I've known Mateo for nine years. Uh, we grew up scootering together at Claremont. And then I met uh, Johnny about two months ago through a mutual friend. My fingers really hurt from this. This is like not a joke. We were doing one at a time, bro. <laughs> we're so stupid. We're... All right, next question. Who's the most sendy and who's the most scared? Most sendy in the entire group? Ooh, I, I would have to say it's me right now. And then the, the scaredest, I would 100% say Johnny. 100,000%. Johnny, no jumped. sense. No sense. We had to we had to beg Johnny to jump off the trampoline into the pool. Dang, this you one's guys are flexing bending. on this side. Yo, yours is like bending. What's a female YouTuber that you would date? Social media girl you would date. There's this girl out there. Her name's Hannah. <laughs> uh -huh. Hannah, I don't know how to pronounce her last name, but I think it's Malak. Oh, the girl that streams? She's so cute. Oh, oh no, she doesn't stream. I don't think she streams. Dang, that's so a lot cute. coming from Baird. I'm just being real with everyone this morning. Alright, go ahead, Brady. <sighs> Shoot. Well, I hear Chloe Bennett's back on the market. Ooh. Ooh. Okay! <laughs> I gotta think, I don't know that many, like, girl... YouTubers and stuff. <laughs> Alright, uh, there's this guy named Tanner Fox. He's pretty cute. That's pretty crazy that you should definitely hit him up. Uh, <laughs> mine is gonna have to be Ma saying. Matilda Tantot. She's an Instagram model. Does that count? YouTuber She's pretty channel. exquisite. This is really like hurting my hands. We've been doing this for so long. Yours is gonna bust, dude. Look at yours. Let's get some better, who knows me better, roommate questions. The entire purpose of this is, you know, for you guys to get to know the roommates more. Hey, man, they're killing us, bro. They're killing us. Yeah, there's about to blow up, and I'm okay with that. <laughs> All right, what's everyone's relationship status? I am single. Baird? I'm single. Baird's single. Mateo, what do you? Oh! 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 <laughs> That's clean, bro. Yo, look, clean. it is wrapped around the guts. Clean. <laughs> gentlemen the man bun has returned <laughs> all right we did it they won high five congrats bro what do you guys win i don't i don't know I don't pop know. tags they win pop tags boom so awesome. that is gonna wrap up today's video i hope you guys enjoyed if you did be sure to drop a fat thumbs up and once again i kind of want to make a video explaining the whole roommate situation a lot of stuff has gone on that i kind of just ignored and not right. talked about up, peace out let's roll the fuck thanks for watching the video guys go cop yourself some merch hottest merch in the game duh uh, subscribe to Tanner Fox, um, and that's it. Watch the next video.